Hey, what's going on, everybody? So a comet that hasn't been seen since the Stone Age will be passing by tonight. You could get a glimpse of it tonight and also in February. So I'm going to show you where you can find it. Um, let's take a look. And right, th this is on LiveScience.com. It says a rare green comet not seen since the Stone Age will zoom overhead tonight. Here's how you can watch it. They haven't even named it yet. The last time Comet C-2022 E3 passed by Earth, modern humans were mingling with Neanderthals. So this is what it looks like. Well, I don't think that's it right there because he, how can we see it if it hasn't been since Stone Age? But a green comet, look at that. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. It's going to be nice. So it says, on February 1st, a comet called C-22E3ZTF, that's a mouthful, will pass by Earth for the first time in 50,000 years, meaning the last time it cruised by our planet, Homo sapiens were still sharing the planet with Neanderthals. And according to calculations from astronomers, the comet will never come back. But you don't have to wait until February to see the comet. There are a few ways to spot it before its closest approach starting today. On Thursday, January 12th, the comet will be in the per perihelion, its closest point to the sun. When comets pass close to the sun, their ice sublimates, meaning it turns into a gas skipping the liquid phase. The sublimation creates a temporary atmosphere called a coma that glows from our point of view. And here we go. So I highlighted this. Starting in the pre-dawn hours of January 12th, the comet could be visible near the northern sky constellation Cor Corona Borealis and then will move westward as time goes on. According to Live Science's sister site, Space.com, it will, if viewing conditions aren't ideal in your area, you can tune into a live stream provided by the virtual project that will start January 12th at 11 p.m. Eastern Time. I'm going to put a link in the description for the Virtual Telescope Project. On the nights of January 26th and 27th, the comet may be visible just east of the Little Dipper's Bowl. Experts expect the comet to be visible to the naked eye by the third week of January. By February 1st, when the comet makes its closest approach to the Earth at 28 million miles away, it will near the constellation Camel or Pardalis. A few days later on February 5th and 6th, the comet will pass to the west of the star Capella and then enter the constellation Auriga. Unfortunately, there is no guarantee you will be able to see the comet. If you live in an area with high light pollution, the comet will be much too faint to see with the naked eye. Even in areas with less light pollution, the closer the comet comes to Earth, the more its light will seem to diffuse over a larger area. Your best bet may be to seek an area with dark, clear skies and avoid using telescopes and binoculars. According to space.com, your eyes should be just fine. And remember, folks, when once you start looking up at the sky at the night, don't be discouraged. Give your eyes a good five, ten minutes or so. Get a chair or something and something with your neck, like a neck brace that you could have a neck support. Because it takes a good 10, 15 minutes or so, sometimes even 20 for your eyes to become acclimated with the sky. And you'll see more and more as you're looking up. So, um, Comet 2020, a C-2022 E3 was discovered by Frank Maskey and Bryce Boland in March 2022. The astronomers spotted the comet using the Zewicki Transient Facility at the Palomar Observatory in Southern California. At the time of its discovery, the comet was within the orbit of Jupiter, nearly 400 million miles, let me pause that, sorry, a um, million miles from the sun. Well, that's it, and you know what? Uh, this is the Virtual Telescope Project. Let me make this a little bigger here. I'm going to put a link to this guy. Let me make that a little smaller. Um, and you go view asteroids and stay tuned because I have uh, videos I'm going to be bringing out on some good stuff with the Neo Surveyor. All right. So you'll receive exclusive and amazing images of the stomach comet. Comet. Ba -ba -ba. 
Okay. Uh, let me see. Where is it? Okay. So I guess, you know what? We'll just look at this one right here. Let me just bring this up for a second. It's going to be live in seven hours. Let me open up this website. Well, it's a YouTube page. Oh, wow. Look. So that's just a background image. So that's not a live shot. I'm going to notify myself. It's going to start tonight, January 12th, 11 p.m. Eastern time. Um, all right, folks. Well, enjoy. I hope you do get to see it. It's um, It should be like the Green Lantern in the sky. And it's rare that we get a treat to watch um, uh, a comet going by. You know, so let's see what happens. I wish you the best of luck. Keep looking up. Take care.